Blair uh, called you out right away, right after the the news broke. Were you thinking, okay, maybe maybe that that might be the replacement guy? Yeah. Um, well, he was never offered to me, but I tagged uh, Golden Boy. It looked somebody, loads of people tagged me in, in his post. I tagged Golden Boy straight away because the most important thing for me is fighting. No matter who, I'm prepared to fight Virgil Ortiz. So anybody else ain't ain't gonna ain't gonna worry me. Do you know what I mean? So. Um, so yeah, uh, obviously maybe Golden Boy, that was their last resort. They managed to come up with an opponent for me regardless. Um, so yeah, I, I would have fought anybody. Um, respect goes out to Blair for calling my name. Um, I, am, I am the ticket this week. They all want that McKinson fight. So uh, but he needs to, he's got a very tough fight on his hands. So he needs to have put his full focus on Alexis. I've, I've got a dangerous fight because I'm fighting an unknown big punching uh, Mexican and this is banana skin for me. This is a banana skin moment for me so I can't lose focus. I've got to put my full attention on this guy and like they said, I'll get through my fight. The winner, of the, I don't want the loser, I want the winner of them guys. Then they deserve the fight with McKinson. You know? Do you feel uh, a victory on Saturday I, don't, I mean, I don't know what, what's the deal with Virgil, if that's gonna, you, it's a, there's a rematch uh, in place for that, or, or maybe, maybe it puts you a step closer to fighting you know, Conor Ben over there. Yeah, I, I don't know. Everyone wants to fight Conor Ben in the UK. I've, uh, everybody I've does? <laughs> ev ev everybody has exp like, I've expressed it for a long time, and nothing's ever come of it. Um, he's got his path. I've got my path. It would be a dream to fight him, but... I don't know if there's a chance for that at the moment. So, um, so yeah, like I'll fight anybody, but I've got to impress because everybody's c coming to watch the guy that was fighting Virgil Ortiz. So if I don't impress, there's no point talking about Virgil Ortiz. There's no point talking about Jaron Ennis, Rashidi Ellis. Like these guys are good fighters, super future superstars. I want my name along them guys. So. I've got to put in a good performance firstly, get the win. And then whoever, I'll come back, I'll come back. Like this is my chance to impress the Americans. Right. You know, I want to win lots of supporters over here and you know, respect to everybody. I've got respect to, uh, to all of the white awaits over here. Um, but I'm here to, this is a dream to be here. You know, this is a dream to be here. I, I've not got the guy I came for, but I've got still my US debut. So I'm a lot just to look forward to still a lot to look forward to. Speaking of you, you mentioned Ennis, you made, you mentioned uh, Rashidi. I feel like the the top prospects maybe are Vir uh, Rot Welterweight, are Virgil, Ennis, Conor Ben. Of those three, rank rank those three. One, two, three for me. Number three is Conor Ben, one thousand um, percent. Jaron and Virgil. Me personally. Virgil, I don't know. I'd, I'd, I'd have them on par with each other because Jaron is a very, very good fighter and a lot of people would pick him over Virgil. Um, I, I was due to fight Virgil, so I should keep him at number one. Because <laughs> <laughs> if you get it, then you yeah. see it looks even better. Yeah, yeah, so Virgil, Jaron, but Conor Ben's not in their league. Wow. Why do you say that? Why, why he's not. Say? He's not. He's just not in their league. What, something he, you see? Or he, he, you, no, no, no. Gym stories or something? No, or? no, not gym give, stories. Give me the inside scoop, bro. <laughs> yeah, it, 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 look, with Connor, at the beginning of his career, very vulnerable. He weren't, his improvements have been unbelievable. His rise has been great. It's been good to watch. He's great for the TV and stuff. But whilst I'm accepting fights against future superstars, 23 year old tipped for superstardom, he's fighting 37 year old has beens. You know, um, they're, he's, they're very careful in the fights he's picking. Look, Connor's a very good fighter. I'm not saying, ah, oh, but I just don't believe he's earned the right yet to be on Virgil Ortiz's and uh, Jaron Ennis's level. Not yet. Like, I've got respect for Connor. He's a lovely guy um, and he's, he's improved a hell of a lot. He's a very improved fighter. I don't know. Um, over in the States how you guys see it but over in the UK probably one of the most improved fighters over there and he's a, he's a world class fighter now I just don't believe he's on Ortiz and 
Ennis's level because he would be calling him out. Interesting, very interesting. Michael, I can't wait to see you, man. I'm so glad they, they salvaged the fight for you and, and we, we still get to see you fight. Thank you so much for your time, man. Appreciate it. Best of luck.